Hello, my name is Cindy Caravello and I'm from OTS Training. In this video, I'm going to be talking to you about the new TU Timesheet Reporting System. This video will focus on how regular exempt, 12-month faculty regular, 10-month faculty, lecturers, and contingent to exempt employees record time and leave using this new system. Let's begin by logging into the system. Type mytu.towson.edu in the address bar of your preferred browser and press enter. We are using Chrome in this video. Please note you cannot use Internet Explorer. From the top right corner of the page, click Sign In and then enter your NetID and password and click Login. Please note you may have to authenticate through Duo. From the MyTU page, click on the Timesheets tile. Information such as your name, employee ID, internal job title, department, and manager will display. Under Pay Period, the current Pay Period Begin Date will be shown. You can view previous and future Pay Periods by clicking the Previous and Next buttons. For exempt employees, eight hours of regular time or holiday leave, if applicable, will be added automatically to the timesheet for each day of the Pay Period. You can view this in the Time block beneath the date. To revise the existing time block with a new reporting code, such as sick or personal leave, click on the time block for the appropriate date and time. In the time entry box, click the drop-down arrow under time reporting code and choose the appropriate code from the list. Enter the number of hours under quantity and click save. If you need to add an additional time and reporting code to a specific date, for example, where you may have some hours for regular time and some for sick leave, you can do so by clicking the yellow plus sign under the existing time banner on a date. Select the appropriate time reporting code and quantity and then click Save. The time blocks under the date will reflect the selected codes and hours. After reviewing the timesheet for accuracy, it's time to submit your timesheet for approval. Review the timesheet total at the top of the screen and make sure you have accounted for all time worked during the current pay period. When you're sure the timesheet is correct, click Submit. A dialog box asking you to confirm your timesheet submission will appear. Click OK. The green box should appear briefly at the top of your screen confirming that you've successfully submitted your timesheet. A yellow status indicator that reads Needs Approval will appear in the upper right corner of each time block. Once your timesheet has been approved, a green Approved check mark will appear in the right corner of each time block. To check your leave balance, click this button at the top of the Timesheets page. Each leave code that you've used throughout your tenure with TU will appear here in a tile. The number of hours accrued, as well as your year-to-date totals, will be displayed on each tile. For an in-depth report, click View Accrual History. You may also enter leave from any leave balance tile by clicking the Enter Leave button. The time entry box will appear with the time reporting code for the selected leave tile pre-filled. Select the start and end date and the quantity of hours for each day, then click Save. You will be returned to the Timesheets tab and the newly entered time will be visible under the appropriate date. When you have completed your timesheet, click Sign Out in the upper right hand corner. Thanks for watching. For more information or questions, please visit us at towson.edu forward slash OTS training.